Christ the Lord is risen today. Angels roll the stone away from the tomb where he lay. Little children come and sing, glory, glory to the King, Christ the Lord of everything. The earth shook with the news. He is not here. He is risen. And in that moment, joy replaced despair. Hope pushed past fear. Life conquered death. And not just on that day, but for eternity. And we celebrate the resurrection of Jesus Christ for what it meant then and what it means for us every day. A sacrifice that brings forgiveness, renewal, and peace to any of us who put faith in Jesus. Isaiah 53, 1 through 6. Who had believed our report, and to whom is the arm of the Lord revealed? For he shall grow up before him as a tender plant, and as a root out of a dry ground. He had no form nor comeliness, and when we shall see him, there is no beauty we should desire him. He is despised and rejected a man, a man of sorrows and acquainted with grief. And we hid our faces from him. He was despised and we esteemed him not. Surely we had formed our griefs and care and our sorrows, yet we did esteem him, stricken, smith of God, and afflicted. But he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon him, and with his stripes we are healed. All we like sheep have gone astray. We have turned everyone to his own way. And the Lord hath laid on him the iniquity of us all. Isaiah 53, 1 through 6. Christ our Lord is risen today. Angels blow the stone away. From the tomb where he lay, little children come and sing glory, glory to the King, Christ the Lord of everything. Jesus is worthy. Then thousands upon thousands of angels sang together. Worthy is the Lamb who was slain to receive power and wealth and wisdom and strength and honor and glory and blessing. Revelations 5.11 